In today's video, I'm going to talk about a plugin for SketchUp for doors and windows. My name is Katarina, I'm a garden designer, and I see you next. So welcome to another video from Garden Design Tools. In today's video, I'm going to talk about the Velia Architects uh, plugin for doors and windows, and it's called Instant Door Window. Let me just quickly go here and show you instant door window so if you remember my last if you i don't know if you have seen it or not but if you go and check out my last sketchup video i've talked about their plugin for roofs instant roof one of the best roof plugins i've actually tried uh, actually was my first but i think it's, it's such an amazing plugin and after in the comments of that video someone was talking about the other plugins they actually have and i was intrigued because when I did the purchase of the roof one, um, I wasn't really concerned with the other ones. I was really concentrated on just having uh, the roofs, uh, the roofs plugin. Uh, but actually, I went and investigate a little bit better, and they are really, really good. So this is their uh, page. This is their uh, uh, plugins page. I'm just going to go here in, into the, their shop. So they tell you all the, their um, uh, sketch of plugins and they are amazing. Okay. They're really, really cool. So I actually had purchased only the roof one and I was happy about with it. You know, um, I don't remember the price now anymore, but um, right now I actually uh, contact them and I, they refund me that one after I purchased the instant architecture. That means all their plugins are um, subscribed. It's $118 a year. But you know, if you're doing this professionally, I think it's really worth it. So I'm gonna do a video for each one of them. Uh, but I really hadn't had the time to actually investigate and research and properly work and try out the, each one of them. But I just did bits and pieces. What I like, to be honest, I did fences. Uh, I, I've tried the fences one. I tried the roof. I tried the, um, the door and window and not much else, to be honest. Um, but they are, I tried the stairs as well, but they're really, really cool. And they are really easy to understand. Okay. So, and one thing I love about the instant door one is that in the doors, they are dynamic. Okay. So if you don't know what I mean, let me just go here and put the dynamic component toolbar on is that you can open and close their doors. It doesn't work for windows, only for the doors and the gates. Okay. The gates, they work as well. Let me just go and show you. You can see here, there is a gate there. Okay, and it closes and it's really, really amazing. So it's fairly easy. Okay, if you go here and you um, press that instant uh, create a door window, you have here, you know, you can choose each one of them. Okay, if you go to a specific thing, let's talk, let's see just all of them. And you have here, they, he always shows you the little examples. Okay, uh, you have here all these examples. It starts with all these different windows. You can choose the materials. You can choose the dimensions. It's really, really complete. Um, and it's an amazing, it's an amazing plugin to start with. So you have all these types of doors. You have glass doors. Uh, you have the gates. You have this amazing um, skylight doors, uh, windows, sorry. Um, here more uh, windows and you have here the vents you can see the vents here it's really really cool i really like the, I, I i'm in love with these plugins um i just didn't have time to to actually explore because i have so much 
work professionally because the best way to explore all these plugins is actually when you have a rest period and you're just having fun and trying things out and that's what I'm missing uh, to me right now and you have all these materials that you can apply so for example if I choose just this a simple uh, window okay you just close it and now it's selected you can see here you have all these uh, things and you can create your own styles and record them for future reference so you don't have to do them all the time um, of course you do you do the double wall you want it in, in not just in 3d but double wall um, you have all these things and it shows you every time you have this uh, this um, options you can see these little thumbnails and it shows you exactly what are you talking about okay frame depth parameter okay i'm not going to choose the materials but basically uh, the materials that they appear here in this window need to be in the model somewhere so make sure before you actually want to uh, uh, apply a material here you have them uploaded into your sketchup or you already using it from your uh, SketchUp default library. Okay, that way you can come here and you can select that material. Okay, if not, it's just gonna put you by default and glass, uh, the default uh, material, you can apply it later, but you know, it's a bit more work. Uh, and you have all these parameters, okay? You have this, um, the main parameters, okay? So you have this, types of windows and uh, this uh, the glass etc uh, you have the width the height uh, the window thickness you have this detail of the casement you can just leave it by default to try it on first but you can have a, a lot of details so it is really you know it's really quite amazing um, and you always have these examples that I love he actually did all these little thumbnails so it gives you exactly an example, you know, because this is changes a lot from country to country. Some countries they choose, they, they try uh, things differently and you can actually do your own, you know, it shows you, I will uh, add the, their uh, YouTube uh, channel as well. They have little videos and it shows you that you can actually do your own finishes for the frame, for example, and he adds them here in the plugin and it's all everything automa um, automatic after. So it's really, really amazing. So you make the window. Okay, right now I didn't put any measurements, so I'm just gonna apply it here somewhere. So and you have here an example of other doors as well. As you can see here, you can close all the doors and open all the doors so it's really really cool and if you if you want to create specific doors for your site for your project and you know open on closing them um, depending of how you want to do your renderings this is amazing plugin okay so this ones they are they don't open as you can see the windows they don't open but all the doors when is you click here to activate and you can slide them and it's all closed okay so i really happy with this plugin i think it was a really good investment uh, and this is not a new plugin so i just wished i knew this plugin um earlier uh, on uh, but yeah it's really really cool so let me know what you think i'm gonna try and do more videos um, on their plugins and may with better information once i really get into it because i'm just trying to right now to figure them out i just wanted to show you to share with you because i really think it's a good investment um check out the links in the description of the video and let me know what you think see you guys in the next one